Are you happy? Yeah! I'm not happy. I'm never happy. I don't remember when I was last happy. Oh. Hi, welcome oh, friends. to... <laughs> Ow, my balls. <laughs> welcome to Ready Players, fucking hell. Fuck. Yeah! Who's the... I did a Tristan. Yay! After fucking 30 minutes of Ghost Runner and fucking up, finally it's his turn. Anyway, it's Tristan and Jack for... Not Ghost Runner. Oh, no, I'm the fuck up now. <laughs> now I'm the fuck. No, I'm the fuck. Please. Uh, welcome to Ready Players. We're playing Angst Patrol. <laughs> Angst Patrol. Sorry, boys. King Angst. <laughs> How much money have we got? 6,000? Yeah. Last year, last year we had 37. Oh. The Harvester? Ooh. Is that interesting? I don't know. I'll never tell. Uh, Sorry, I needed to money. have a little hiccup. Does that make a uh, scythe cooler? I can't tell. <laughs> uh, I can't. Is it different? Oh, it's in the fucking wall. Come on, scythe. Hurry up. Oh, yeah. Uh, that was pretty cool. Uh, it's, it's a it bit of like an HR there. Giga scythe. Uh, I'd shove it in my butt. Oh, it's HR Giga scythe. You'd probably want to. Oh, no. <laughs> Have you seen, have you rewatched any of those trailers for that, like, that HR Giga first person shoot, like Scorn, I think it's called? Um, I haven't rewatched them recently, but I remember them. I just remember, like, I rewatched it recently because, like, they showed off a bit of a gameplay demo recently for, like, the Xbox Series uh, the X. actual gameplay. Yeah. Interesting. Which does look very creepy and gross, but, oh. like, I remember the trailer, it just, like, has a fucking. <laughs> this weird thing comes out where it's, like, out of a wall where it just looks like a big horse penis. So I was like, that's weird. And then it starts oozing light stuff. We're like, oh, no! It is a penis. Oh, hello, you. Wait, where's my headphones? Yours. <gasps> oh, he's cool. You know me, but I don't know you. But I don't like. Oh, then. <laughs> they gave his his beard a nice. His beard is nice and tasty now. I like his nose. Yes. These big hands have done many things, laddie. Well, you're welcome to give it another go. After that, I best not catch you around here again. It's you. What's that now? The Black Hammer. It's you. Do your worst. Did the air just like secret, rumble when he did that? Yes, but also I couldn't tell if he was making the cracking noise with his mouth or not. He was just trying to look really badass. Like... Shit. It, we, we know you're not making that noise, dude. Wait, try and use dude on him. See what happens. That seems like a terrible idea. Uh. There we go. Okay, I guess that's a jumper thing. Is it useless against him? He's dude! Maybe get him to jump while he's near the hammer. Oh, I gotta get into demon mode. I get it. Ah! Fuck you! Hooray! There you go. Ooh, friends. Hundred years. <clears throat> Since the day Abaddon was taken from us, I have prayed for this moment. For your oh, this are bad ass. Tried in the White City, but until this world is free of the Destroyer, its gates are closed to us, and justice will not wait. I sentence you here and now. No, <gasps> <gasps> oh, bitch. They're touching their swords. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. Justice can wait till we finish our little scrap, Missy. There ain't no sport in jumping into a tussle that don't concern you. Go on, fly away, pigeons. If I'm a pluck ya. Blasphemer, it is you who takes sides in a battle that doesn't concern you. Aw, <laughs> oh, buddy. 
I like that. Presumably, the hammer's not magical. It's just fucking heavy. It's just really big. <laughs> oh no! Did he squish that guy? Yeah, he did. Oh no! There he is. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no! That guy from Warhammer's dead. <laughs> Oh no. I love him. <laughs> it's cool. The game suddenly became much less sort of... Uh, that's right, now we have to fight to see who's better at this. Oh god. It's so weird seeing we're about to fight a bunch of angels with a big, with a big friend. And then we get the fucking thing of, find the subway entrance! Yeah, that was a bit weird. Alright, I need to keep them away from him, because he will fuck them up super easy. Do you win? Like, do, do, what happens if you let him win this? Um, I think we need to win... Or we might just get an achievement, I can't actually remember. But... I definitely want to win. <laughs> this fucking Thanatos battle from Hades. Yeah, pretty much. Have you beaten one of those yet? Actually? Oh yeah, I beat them pretty often these days. Yeah. It depends on the weapon I've got. That's like, true, actually. I can, sometimes if it's just like a low damage thing, then I'll, I'll just never get it in time. Yeah, that's fair. Wait, come here. He's like, well, I didn't want to lose, but okay, you win. <laughs> there was, um... Oh, he's catching up. There was actually a point where he mentioned... Oh, no. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. <laughs> Alright. Um, I had his, uh, his pendant. Yeah. And he was like, oh, so you've got my pendant. Just stand back and I'll level it up for you. Oh. Like he was like, just don't get hurt, basically. Aww. Don't be a bitch. Oh, thank you. That a nice man. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> Cargo broom. Ow! Oh. What an asshole. <laughs> what an angel. What an angel. What a nice angel. Oh god, man. You know what I've been missing for some reason lately oh. from fucking lockdown crap? Go to the movies. I don't I... like watching movies that much, but tell you what, fucking I've been wanting to watch movies a lot lately. That's fair. Yeah, I used to never watch movies anyway, but like, it would be nice to have the option. <laughs> I mean, we kind of do these days. Yeah. There's just nothing really out. No, I mean, there's, like, Netflix stuff that's kind of cool. Yeah, well, why don't we watch a movie? Okay. Don't you... Wait, am I not I wanna, good enough? No, you are. <laughs> but I want to show you... I want to fucking watch the stupid Sylvester Stallone movie where he has to beat a tunnel. Sorry? Oh, like, a tunnel... Like, a fucking highway tunnel collapses. Uh-oh. And he has to, like, fucking... Do some weird Fast and the Furious-style stunts in the 90s to get to it... To save the people inside. It's basically like, it's a weird cross between Mission Impossible and like, fucking, uh, Roland Emmerich movie. Oh, weird. Oh, the bird like, exploded. what if an earthquake destroyed this tunnel and people got trapped inside? We've got to send our best guy in there. Oh, shit! I just remembered, because we've been watching, because Tom and I have been, like, uh, go, going into a weird habit of, like, going to JB Hi-Fi and trying to find the worst movies to watch. Oh. Uh, Why? Well, because, like, JB Hi-Fi <laughs> has some good... There's, like, a particular brand that only JB Hi-Fi seems to sell, which does a bunch of, like, Ozploitation. Oh. Okay. Ozploitation and, like, really weird, like, weird B-movies or, like, low-budget movies. Like, lower-budget movies. And one of them was a... Kung Fu crime thriller set in Perth called Day of the Panther, and the main character's name is Jason Blade. Holy shit. Guy's name is Jason Blade. But the guy who's the actor is so shit. Like, uh -oh. he, the only act, the, he only knows how to act in smirk. Oh. So his only talent is smirking, sometimes punching dudes in a way that's kind of, kind of impressive. Like, his Kung Fu skills aren't really that amazing. They're just like... Yeah, all right, I guess. I mean, I guess yeah, I can believe that he's beating up dudes, but it's not really all that cool. Right. But, like, the only things he does in that movie are beat up dudes, smirk, Titanfall. answer the phone. What? Answer the phone with, hello, Jason Blade. Wow. And then get out of cars. That's, that's a majority of his scenes. And then there's also a guy in there that looks a lot like one of our friends. 
But in the 80s, I was like, ah! What are you doing here? Ah! What's happening? He's like a slightly... He's like a slightly chubby dude. Very big, thick beard. And he wears sunglasses really well. And I was like, is this just our mate? Like... What the fuck is going on in this movie? Which one are you talking about? Um... Lachlan. I don't think you've met him. Oh, okay. But it's like, if I if I showed you a picture of him and showed you the guy in the movie, you'd be, you'd like, be oh, like, it's the same person. Yeah, it's like, what the <laughs> fuck? These two pictures are the same. Yeah. <laughs> but um, <laughs> there was that, and then we also, oh, we watched Twilight with the uh, director's commentary on. Uh, I saw um, he was making posts about that. Yeah, Tom and I, we just like sort of live tweeted us watching that a little bit. Yeah, that movie's so boring. Like, the, the commentary's funny because basically it's just, um... <laughs> What the fuck is oh. the guy's name? Not Patrick Stewart, because I'm a... The guy who um, plays Edward. Uh, Patrick Dempsey. Sure. Um, oh god, it's gonna piss me off if uh, I don't know that. Just look it up. I'm, I'm gonna look it's gonna it drive me insane as well if I don't look it up. But yeah, that guy is very much radiating high energy because he's like just ripping on the movie. The whole time, like, he's just like pointing out, Hey, because it's him, the director, and Kirsten Stewart. Yep. Or Kristen Stewart. Uh, Kristen Stewart's making fun of her acting. Really? Because she's like, I was told this was meant to be, like, a really important scene, so I was like... And also the directions were, like, a little bit weird. Like, in one bit she's being told, alright, look like you're having a really intense flashback. And then she's, like, fluttering her eyes and, like, holding her head back, like... <laughs> okay. And, was, like, and then there's, like, making fun of, like, how kind of stupid it looks with the director in the same room as them. That's great. It was like the director's like giving us a little trivia like about the movie, like, oh yeah, no, we got this shot because there was this really nice family that let us use their house for the weekend so we could shoot this film. It's like, oh, that's kind of cool. And then fucking Edward Cullen's fucking actors over here, like, hey, have you guys heard of Garden Burger? <laughs> like, wow, I was right. talking to the chick from fucking, um, I was talking to the chick from fucking Evanescence about it. <laughs> okay. Uh, Garden Burgers. So I guess they're talking about like veggie burgers, you should call veggie burgers Garden Burgers because it sounds a little bit cooler. Yeah. Something like that. And then there's like a scene where he's in the background talking to some other characters and he's like, oh yeah, in this scene I was telling them how much I really like cookies. <laughs> and he's like, I want you to be my friend. <laughs> you seem like a really cool guy. Yeah, God gun. Oh, cool. Oh, what was the other one? But yeah, no, he's like, he's like talking to the director and he's like asking these questions like, hey, why is this happening in the movie? I thought this was meant to happen. He's like, Shut up, shut up, shut up, please. Shut up, <laughs> please shut up. Like, she's really, she doesn't know how to answer because all the plot points don't make sense. Because half great. because it's Twilight, but also half because the filmmaking is not that great. I love it. Oh, it's so weird. It's so, but like, watching Twilight on its own, like, besides that, like, it doesn't really add much to the movie. It makes it a bit more interesting when nothing is going on, which is almost all of the movie. But like, it... It's just, there's just so, the, it's weird to think that the movie, that the movie had the fucking five movie franchise. Really? Jesus. Yeah, that's five movies, like, it's got book one, two, three, and then four was split up into two, because that was the thing at the time, because Harry Potter did it. Yeah. So, they, yeah, it's got five movie franchise, and I'm just looking at it like, this budget sucks, like, this movie looks a lot like, this looks like ass. And then you look at, like, the next, and, like, the next ones are like, wow, the CGI actually looks pretty alright. Oh, really? Yeah. The movies apparently, like, get... There's, like, the last movie apparently is, like, really fucking entertaining because it just gets so fucking dumb. Like, you know, the werewolf boyfriend, imp like, imprints on a baby. Oh, yes, I've heard of that. Yep, and then there's, like, an entire scene where all of the characters are killing each other and, like, all, like, the bad guys and the good guys are killing each other in, like, this fucking um, Infinity War-style scene. And, like, Dangerous. all the book fans are like... That's not what happens! What's going on? And then it turns out to be like a fucking vision that one of the characters gives the bad guy. I was like, if you do this, this is, you'll die. And it was like, oh, I guess I won't kill you. Bye. Right. <laughs> That's it. Okay. Such I'm a to weird die. film. Yeah, you are. Wow. How many enemies are you killing? Fuck me. I mean, I have a big gun, actually. Watch out. I was just going to use my magic juice. Can I just use it? Yes. 
Oh, I was wondering what. Yeah, we put that in the fucking top. I was wondering what the green thing was. Yeah, I remember you used it really early on. No, that's right, because I was bad. You really didn't need to use it. No, but anyway. I was bad. Oh, he wants me to do something. Where is he? Where, where is he, actually? Yeah. Oh, he's over there. He is over there. He's getting all the kills before you do! It's not fair. <laughs> oh, no! You're losing! Shush. By a... <laughs> it's like the Electoral College, you're losing even though you're in front! <laughs> Ugh. Thought we weren't doing that. <laughs> oh, that's just a reference, it's fucking You're a anything. reference. I know, it's just culturally true. You're culturally true. I am culturally true, thank you. Don't know what that means, but... Neither do I. I. <laughs> <laughs> Friends! Daka 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 daka. I wish I had guns. So do I. You can get gel guns. Oh uh, yeah, the gel blasters. Yeah, the gel blasters. We've got a gel blaster shop not too far away. Oh god, I just removed a fucking- while we were over in- while we were on our holiday with me and Tom. Oh sorry, me and Tom were on our holiday, you weren't there. I know. I know. We were like, in- I can't- I can't remember exactly where we were, but we were like, somewhere on the sunny coast. Um, and we passed by a billboard for gel blasters. And Tom- I'm driving the car at this point, and Tom goes, Oh, that's what gel blasters are! They're guns! It's like- what the fuck did he think What the fuck were? did you think they were? I was like, oh, I thought it was like a cosmetic thing, like, you know, fucking a pedicure or something, but he's like, but it's like, um, I'm assuming he thought like it was a facial thing, or they like just blast this like cooling gel on your face or something. Oh boy. I don't oh, know. Tom. But, uh, but, but he was innocent like, gay. It was just like, he just, he honestly just like legit thought that it was like, it was a facial treatment where, you know, they just like have this little, it's like high pressure hose that like, little tiny high pressure hose that like, just like blast your pores with this cleansing gel or something like that. Uh, what a good boy. <laughs> what a good boy. But uh, it was just funny. It was like, no, they're guns. It was like, oh, that makes way more sense. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, it was great. Although I actually legit have wanted to get a gel blaster, though. They look really cool. Yeah. Well, it's like, because in Australia, we, we don't get BBs. We can't use BBs because they're legitimately counted as like guns and you know because Australia doesn't like guns. Yeah. I mean gel blaster does sound interesting but I want like something really ridiculous is the problem. Oh yeah. Oh I get you like you want like a gel blaster cross with a nerf gun. Without the bat without the you know the inferiority of the nerf having a nerf gun. I need like the smart gun or the pulse rifle from aliens. <laughs> ah yeah that'd be cool. You just want to you just want an actual like remnant of the fucking uh, the waste mounted gun. Oh yeah, well that's the smart gun. That's the smart gun. That's right, yeah. I don't remember these things. You picked Oh, is that the same gun? Yeah. Oh. Try to bring up my gun. God. I wanted to continue to win. I think I've got enough of an advantage that I'm probably not going to lose. Yeah, probably. <laughs> it's like, and then 30 more minutes of this crap. What the fuck did he do? He smashed that. Oh. oh. He got me some health, because he's a good boy. Oh, what a nice man. Chungus, 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 chungus. <laughs> it's just like, he's the shape of a dwarf, but, but he's, he's fucking large. Huge. It's great. What a weird combo. It's honestly making me think of that Peter Dinklage giant from um, oh, fucking no. Infinity War or whatever it was. Yeah. Uh, who the fuck was it? I remember seeing someone see it, like say like, "Oh, I see that they're just trying to do all of the PR, all the good, all the PR good points. They've made a midget a giant. See, I was like, what? <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, people are strange. It was like SJW bullshit putting a fucking a guy, a little person in, in a giant role. I was like, I think that's the joke, my dude. Oh boy. Now my sword's all blue and glowy. Oh, I love cool. faster. And he just throws his hammer at her. It's me all worked up just thinking about killing her, but I'll settle for watching you do it. Gotta watch out for Patrick Stewart. He might beat me at Connect Four again. Asshole. Ooh, sir. <laughs> Oh, I hope there's more of that. Fuck the Snoop Dogg menu log fucking oh, ads. Just... I just want more of that. Also, it was Uber Eats, not menu log. I apologize from the last episode. Oh, 
Oh man, she is. You know what I've been really craving, by the way, that like, as of lately, that I've just been too lazy to try and go get? Fucking KFC. <laughs> I've been KFC in a while. We've got a KFC near us, but it's oh, a wow. shit just KFC. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Oh, just that you just killed us so quickly. I, she literally didn't get a hit on me. Oh. Poor girl. And she's just passed out and her wing's like, uh-oh. <laughs> she was being carried off by two other enemies. Oh, I didn't see that. I just thought it was just her own wings like, uh-oh. Aw, <laughs> buddy. Gentle nudge. It <laughs> pushes an entire body out of the way. <laughs> you kill that griever. Even make it back out to that hole. That'll be proof enough. Then I promise. We'll I mean, works. tell you what. At least with this game, when you have to do random bullshit to get power-ups, it makes sense. Mm. It's not like a goddess going like, You've got to find the holy pizza. <sighs> with hero toppings. This guy's like, I'm pretty sure you're one of the four horsemen, but you're kind of shit still. Yeah, you know, you're really weak for a fucking horseman, so prove yourself and I'll do it. <gasps> Try and hold for me to shove myself into. Oh, oh finally. My little chode of a body. <laughs> oh, yay. Ugh, it's the water temple. Oh, God. It's not the worst water temple I've ever had to deal with, but like... It's a video game and it's a water level. It's gonna suck. It's still gonna suck. Luckily, you don't. You got like infinite air. Oh yeah, so it's like it's not the worst that it could be. I don't think there's too much like water level shenanigans. I could be wrong. It does remind me though of the water temple. I don't think I've had an issue with that temple. I never played Ocarina, so I only know like stories. Sorry. That's alright. No, that's alright. It, um, it's more like I played on the 3DS, so I had it easy. Oh. So I think the frustration people had was just the swapping, but because you've got the 3DS screen, you can just go like, eh, 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 and it's done. And you got the color coding and stuff. Yeah, exactly. So it's like, oh, it's not really that fucking hard. And then I realized, like, oh, isn't that bad? And I'm like, all oh, right. They did modify it to make it easier. Because they realized people were really pissed at that. Oh, hi. Oh, shit. Oh, pardon me. Oh, it's the boss. Woo! Wait, really? This early? Or is it just like... Is this just a taste of things to come? Ow. Ah, why? I wish I could just shoot like a scrim laser. <laughs> <laughs> then people would know I'm sad. <laughs> ah, I just fucking aim it upwards. <laughs> I'm just like, oh no, Jack's upset. <laughs> I've got to go to my friend. Oh no, that clock, I guess. Are you wearing both your headphones, or are you getting like him sort of fading in and out? He's fading in and out, yeah. Depending on which side he's on. Ah, uh -huh. fucking Zelda. Tell you what, I re after the last episode of the, oh, like the first episode, the, the last episode of recordings we did for this before this session, really fucking hope the audio works. Oh shit, yeah. Really, really don't want to do that again. That was really fucking annoying. It what, deleted, like, the last half of the episode or something? Like, 20, like, 10 minutes. Like, 10, 15 minutes. But it was also an extra long episode as well, so, yeah. Wasn't the worst thing that could have happened, I guess? No, it happened in, like, that last big, like, enemy chamber, right after you get the swelly spinny thing. Yeah, I remember. I watch our things. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> when they're good. When <laughs> Fuck you. Which, Deadly Premonition, which just watching you be sad. Oh god, that was traumatic to watch. <laughs> it brought back so many emotions. Uh, None of them good. I know, like, I, I know I feel bad. I feel bad for doing it, but fuck me, I love going back to that last, like, minute and a half. Just watching you just be really upset. 
God, I didn't. I, I got so upset. You got like it's a it's an upset. It's like Kingdom Hearts didn't make you upset. In the same way. <laughs> in the same way, it just made you. Well, that was more just like God. This is so stupid. And this one is like I will actually hurt you if you make me play any more of this. Yeah, that was it was crazy. It was like wow. All right, fuck me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't realize it was getting to you that bad. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah. Well, because you were holding it in, that's the thing. It's like, ugh, 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 ugh. It just, it got to me. Yeah. Oh. Um, no. Nom, 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 nom. No. And here's my Ozzy Osbourne impression. Nom, 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 bats. Fucking Ozzy Osbourne, man. I think you mean... Larry Osborne. <laughs> just remember. Shut up. <laughs> it was just that part of that weird time in the fucking mid. Oh. Ooh, hello, friend. Oh, okay. Is that? What are you trying to? What are you gonna do here? I don't fucking know. I'm just looking around. Fair enough. Sorry. What are we, we were talking about? Ozzy Osborne. Oh, I was just thinking about like just that weird time in like the mid to early 2000s when reality TV became a thing. Ugh. Yep. And then we're just like, oh, yeah, people. No, people are pretty alright, but what about celebrities? <laughs> That's right, they're fucked up on drugs and wealth. Yeah, they're way more fucked up than the normal dude, and then they're like fucking... Not Kim... It wasn't at that time, Kim Kardashian wasn't the thing. It was like... Uh... S Samantha... No. Dumb... Dumb blonde singer. Can't remember her fucking name. Wow. I'm, I don't care. I don't want to say anyone's name because I don't know. Paris Hilton? Paris, Paris Hilton was one of them. Oh, okay. Not Janet Jackson, that wasn't- that's not right. Ah, uh, no, one of them. Um, <laughs> one of the blonders. Wow. Uh, and then they... But yeah, the Ozzy Osbourne one was just so weird, because it was like, Hey, we're gonna watch this guy that's so fucking fucked up on drugs, and he can't speak it- that he can't speak anymore. And we're just gonna watch him- Eat bats. Eat bats and hang out with his family and his wife he might hate. And also his daughter, who was very, <laughs> is very, very weird of a per very weird person. Like, what was it? It was like, oh, that's what it was. It was when she tried to, she was on like The View or something. I was like Janet Osborne or whatever the fuck her name is. Emily Osborne, I think it is. Oh, okay. But it was like she's trying to, um, she's trying to win. She's trying to earn a clap for like saying something really woke. Oh. But like, um. It wasn't work? It wasn't work. It was around 2016, so it was probably something about Trump. But it was like, I think he said like something about Mexicans are rapists or something like that. Ugh. One of those really fucking horrible things. And then she's trying to win points by going like, Mexican Mexican people are just that. They're really they're like they're they're also really good at being housekeepers or some shit like that. Oh. And everyone just like, whoa, what? Sorry. I don't think you know how this works. It was something like that, it was like, yeah, no, it was just like something that only a rich fucking dickhead can think of. It was like, I see, I see where you were going, but the math was wrong on the trajectory, and <laughs> you gotta fix it up. Oh boy. But yeah, it was just a very uncomfortable silence while everyone goes like, that's, that's, that's not right, that's not correct. And she's just like, what? What do you mean? But they are. But they, but they are. Such cheap labor. <laughs> they, uh, come on. Uh oh. <laughs> Look, I know your dad ate bats, but do you need to be this batty? <laughs> da -da -da. Oof. That was. <laughs> that was pretty bad. That was, thank you. I'm really proud of that one. <sighs> How dare you shame me for my accomplishments like this? I am full of shame. Me too. Mood. <laughs> Lol, that's a oh. mood. Ooh! I like his little eye. He doesn't look that bad. Oh, oh. I've changed my mind. Not a fan of you, bear. Hug. <laughs> Big hugs. With sword. Oh, I'm really sleepy. <laughs> He's just resting. I wish I could rest. It's no rest for the wicked. You're um, not wicked. Oh, uh, I'm pretty spooky. Uh, Have you seen my nose? No. What? What's spooky about your nose? I'll never tell. It's got a secret tunnel! Oh, God. 
Oh, my housemate just finished watching Avatar last night again. The series? Like... Hey, it was just watching um, an episode <laughs> randomly. Like, has been watching it randomly. Oh, yeah, already yeah, yeah. finished it. Um, but we got to fucking... Uh, like, the, the end of the season. I really want to watch Korra again now. I haven't finished this watching Korra, actually. Jesus, this guy sucks. I watched season one, I was like, that was pretty good, and then I just never bothered watching the rest. Yeah, oh, it got better. Oh yeah, it was like... It was like season three where it finally got good. Well yeah, that's because they knew that they were actually getting a fucking second season following that yeah, one. Yeah, finally. Which is so... I think that's so weird that you have to clarify that to people as well. It's like, oh the first season's pretty good, and the second one's not great. And the third season's good again because they didn't realise that they were... Because the second season they were like just trying to make another se single season story arc. And then the third one they knew they were getting a second season, so, like a season following that, so they just actually made like a better story. Yeah, bad. They had the room for it. They didn't have to rush this time. Oh. Oh, that's the thing though with like Korra, that was like, it's a good, that first season's a good one-off. Like I don't feel like I'm missing out that much on not having more of it. Yeah. You know? It was just sort of rushed. Yeah. Which it had to be. It had to be, but <laughs> it's like, which one of these sexy brothers do I choose? Oh, that, never mind, I'll just choose the sexy girl. Yeah. Yay! Game got confused again. It's like, oh, I don't understand. <laughs> do 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 huh? Huh? <laughs> do 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 huh? Ooh. Treasure. <gasps> Wait for it. Yeah! Just walk away for a while first. <laughs> you finish uh. the boss is like abysmal armor piece! Abysmal. I said abysmal. It's abyssal. Wow. Oh. Abysmal is like depressing. Uh, did we have this conversation last time? We uh, did this at the I don't know. You know I can't read, apparently. I've got like, I've got out loud dyslexia or some shit. I don't know. Out loud dyslexia? <laughs> yeah, I can read fine, but then I have to when I have to read words out loud, it's like, oh, oh no, I'm right. dumb. <laughs> yeah, I do that. <laughs> That's just welcome to my life. And then fucking remember why I did that. I remember I did that in fucking high school where I was like, I was in drama class and they were reading a detective story and it was like, the line is, I'll take the case and my fucking outlet like, I'll do it. I'll take the cake. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm like, oh, everyone laughed. And that's okay. I was used to it because I was, I was a bad, dumb person. No. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you got a wraith. Shard, I we think. have an extra yellow. Oh, cool! Not that it's going to show us you. apparently. There it is. I yeah, found it. you did it. Uh, do, the fan. do you remember where that fan was? No. So I fucking don't. It was water's confusing? Was it like shit. right behind you though? No, oh, it was ages away. Yeah, it was here. You're here. <gasps> I'm here now. Here I am. Oh god, actually, that's reminding me. Fucking movies I do want to watch. You know what? I want to watch a fucking, um, a Neil Breen movie. This is where I thought I was. Oh, see, there's works of pure Breenius. Neil Breen? Yeah. I'll have to show it to you. But, like, it's a... Do you have to? Yes, I do. Okay. It's a director that's like, he acts and directs his own movies, but he's a really bad director. <laughs> oh no. And one of his most recent movies is mostly all stock footage that he's just green screened himself into. And one of the things he does is like, he's got to make a twin, he's like, it's a, it's a story about twins. Mm. Like these twins, so it's a twin of him, but he doesn't have a twin. So when there's a scene of them walking in a, in a forest together, so it's him green screening <laughs> walking through this fucking forest. And then a smaller version of him walking towards the... Getting bigger to make it look like he's also walking towards the camera. Oh no, is it like the fucking uh, guts walking animation garbage? It's not that bad, but, okay. it do, but it's by very much of the same quality of like, bro, you could have done way better than this. Oh dear. <laughs> I forgot about the guts walking. That's so good. It's like... <laughs> Ooh, now it glows purple and angry. Ooh. I wish I was purple and angry. I'm just white and sad. No, <laughs> true. I am also white. Ooh, treasure. <gasps> oh my god! What could it be? What is it? What amazing tools! What tool are we getting today? Is it a fire glove? 
No. It's just a fucking punching glove. Oh, cool. Oh, souls. So instead of the hammer, which is meant to break stuff, you just get a bigger fist. Yeah. Well, now I've got a fist on each hand instead of just one hand. Oh, nice. Oh, a doggo. <gasps> a clicky doggo. Good for him. Oh, God, they're annoying. Ow. Stop. What? Why do you do this? <laughs> Bark. <gasps> oh! Just funny, he takes out his phone and starts taking little photos. I'm like, yeah. Oh, lots of friends. Oh, no. Did I kill this guy? No, I didn't. They're just being assholes. <laughs> oh, yay! Ride boy! Woo! Aw. Oh. Fuck <laughs> fucking Yakuza housewife where he just takes a photo of his really fat sheep. Uh, <laughs> wait, what's that called? Uh, Yakuza, uh, Way of Housewife, I believe it. Way, uh, of, way of the House Husband. Oh, he's a house husband? He's a house husband. I bought the- I found out that our local manga shop actually sells the manga, so I bought, like, the first cop, the first issue. <laughs> it's fucking fun. He's just this fucking Yakuza... This, like, he's basically Kiryu, if Kiryu became a house husband. Oh, and yeah. stayed with it. <clears throat> Hell yeah. So I mean, Q would if he could. Yeah, it's even called like the fucking the the blood the dread the the bloody dragon or some shit like that. Nice. Uh, the I think he actually is called like the endless dragon or some shit like that. But yeah, no, it's like he just found a wife that he really loves and he became a house husband instead. <laughs> so he's like he's by he's like he's still doing the crit like the really badass um the badass yakuza stuff like his intimidating dudes like he's getting chased by a yakuza clan. He's like. Hold on to the- hold on to this- this- under my bag, I need to go to the sale! <laughs> the, this clothing sale! <laughs> oh, that's great. And, like, he's uh- and it, he's trying to- he's, he's running around in a fucking- and he's trying to find an anime shop so he can find, um... This figurine for his wife, is his Haku wife. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and he's like, he's found it, and then like, he's like- he goes up to the attendant and like, I'm only gonna ask you once. Do you have this figurine? And he's like, go at the fucking attendant one, shut the fuck up. So he just like fucking choke, like choke, um, choke slaps his throat so he stops talking. That's he's great. Like, Tell me where it is. <laughs> and then he buys it and she's like, oh no, what the fuck? <laughs> That's ridiculous. I love it. Oh, I've got to, I'll, I'll fucking loan it to you. It's a really quick read. It's fucking funny. Oh, okay. You said it's getting a um, an anime. It's getting a Netflix adaption, yeah. Oh, oh I'm like fucking so keen for it because it's <clears> it's, <throat> it's good. It just exudes all Yakuza energy, but then it's just about fucking going to the grocery shop. <laughs> yes. <laughs> going to the grocery store and then going to like a fucking department store because they've got a like a, a fucking Black Friday sale on. Yeah. So it's just this fucking dude wearing a really cool suit, an apron with a Shiba Inu on the front, and he's just <sighs> bat and he's just like trying to beat get all these clothes out of this bucket, be trying to beat out all these other housewives to get these gloves. That's ludicrous. <laughs> like, what the fuck is this anime gonna be? Oh, that's right, I forgot about the beholder's key. What? Oh, the beholder's key. That's all. I'm just oh, gonna yeah, stab him. Give him a hug. Hello, hey. friend. Ah! Open. I think we have a bit over time, actually. Before we should right. end it. All right, good. Are we at a? Are we we at were point? busy discussing. I don't know. Probably. <laughs> Punch. Busy discussing house husband. Yeah, I'm assuming I can probably save or find somewhere. I think the um, the dungeons like spawn you back at the start or something. They probably would. It's a fucking Zelda game. So there's probably a point where it'll let me like loop it back around. Okay. Uh, so maybe I'll just like. Oh fuck me. Yeah. We'll just make it work. Okay, well, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll save a video of this so we can come back to it next time. Anyway, bye guys. Bye. If you want to watch our stuff on oh, socials, yeah. you can find that there on, in the description. <laughs> find them that there in the description. You can find our social links in the description. But then you can also go to our Patreon, which is also in the description. And you can send us money if you like what we do to support what we do. And if you do, send us money, that is. Uh, we'll give you some extra stuff in return, such as early access to videos like these and bonus podcast episodes, which we will fucking do, I swear. We've just been trying to catch up on this shit because it's been a very weird time. It has been. Uh, anyway, we'll see you next time, guys. Bye. Love you all. I'm so angsty. Bye. Bye. Hug. No, it's too hot. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, germs. <laughs> you fucking Cut idiot. Out. <laughs> Bye.